Oh, 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 is it gravel? So this is our first evolution. All right. Oh, it didn't have the full dun, 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 sort of music in the background, but that's cool. Hey guys, and welcome yourselves back to the world of Pokemon Quest. I'm jumping right in here, and we have ourselves a Rattata. Why did you have to come and find us? I don't want you. Scratch. A level 22 Rattata. All right, well, you're going straight to help other Pokemon. Uh, oh, is that an Abra? I don't remember getting an Abra last time. Wait, right, let's go. Get... Right, I c can I go into you? Oh, that, that's right. No, 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 dude. It had, um, <clears throat> it had like, oh, no, I didn't. What was the, oh, no, the Drowsy is the one that I did get. No, Abra, Abra level 28. What moves does it have? Oh, no, is this, it's just the, yeah, it's just the one move. I can't even remember if we had this one last time. The user sends pe peculiar rays of light out in three directions, damaging enemies hit by them. Sometimes confuses the enemies. Yeah, no, I do remember this because I had the dual, had the dual heart and the fighting, that's right. So, um, it could be a good Pokemon. I mean, okay, so first of all, we're gonna chuck these in. That's right, I was gonna, I was gonna put these in as soon as I, as soon as I um, started this episode. So, it's been a couple days, guys, I'm sorry. Um, oh, I really want Porygon and I really want a Poliwhirl, what does Poliwhirl have those? We have Geodude, Pikachu, and Porygon. But to be honest, guys, um, Geodude is a huge tank and has that Harden move. And um, and Porygon, I might have to say goodbye to Pikachu. Um, that might be what I'm doing right now. So let's get, let's just have a go at this. So we've got Abra, Geodude, and Porygon. Pikachu is great, but, um, I mean, how are we gonna, we'll have to level him up at some point. Um, okay, so Pikachu's got this though, so we'll put this down here. We could make this a huge attack guy too, because he'll need all the attacking he can get with that. So I don't know whether to add this to it. Actually, he can, he's got another attack already. So Pikachu had that. Um, I need another attack. Pikachu had that, so I can take that from Pikachu. Okay, he's got a lot. I could, I could potentially, oh no, I can't quite go, oh no, I'm gonna give him heart. He needs hearts. Right, so what else did Pikachu have? Pikachu had that. Um, so I might give that to Porygon. I think Porygon needs... Geodude definitely doesn't need any more help in that department. Um, but he's already got 173, so Geodude might be the go. Can't give any more to um, to Porygon. Okay, so 164. Oh, this one's... Oh, no, that's not better. Right, I'll put this one here then. Oh, I could put it... Is that really helpful? Critical hit damage, movement speed, HP upon recovery. Oh, you know what? I'm just going to swap that out for that. All right. So, I think that's a super strong team. Let's jump into some of these expeditions straight off the bat. Because I don't think we're that powerful for the expeditions either. Um, before we do, let's jump in and grab our 53 PM tickets. Ooh, we're sitting at 200. All right, we might buy something later on. I'll just have to do some expeditions first. All right, so what are we sitting at? 3,600. Uh, flying, we can't, we're not quite there for flying. Uh, water, 3,300 we can easily do, and 3,400 we could potentially easily do. We haven't done any of these bugs, so let's jump into the bug one. What's it gonna be? What's at the end, you reckon? Like maybe a pincer? Um, who knows? All right, so what are we gonna get? Oh, eradicate and Meowth. So, so far, no, oh, oh, that's right, it's not bug Pokemon that's in here, is it? It's just bug that gets a boost. That's right, all right. Um, oh, I forgot to check my cooking pot too. I don't think it was ready, was it? Oh, that's right. Dang, damn it, I don't think there's anything in there. All right, we'll jump. I just wanted to get one expedition out of the way so we could start counting up our timer anyway. All right, so, in classic Geodude fashion, he has um, very minimal health taken off. We have... Three drowsies and an Abra. Okay, so we've got an Abra on Abra action here. Oh, it's on. Oh, it was off auto. Hmm. See, this this uh, annoys me. I wish I could move the camera around because I can't see what's happening behind this tree. Someone, someone's going to delete the tree. That is a that is actually a pretty cool attack, Abra. Oh, and, we, and there's stones we can put on that too that I haven't done. Stones maybe to maybe to um regenerate it. Quicker. Right, so we're fighting a Charmander. Charmander and two um, Pidgeotos. 
And that Pidgeotto just glitched out like it for nothing else. Oh, maybe it's just an attack it's got. Right. For, for such a simple game as this, there's, there's actually a lot going on. Like, as far as all the tokens um, and buying stuff goes, and then the level ups and the buffs and the and the um, the modules you can stick on Pokemon's moves and the and the modules you can stick on Pokemon for their attack and, and HP. It's um, it's like after every expedition you can do something different. It's pretty cool. And the and the cooking. Right, just smash that meow those mouths. I want to make Geodude forget tackle. Actually, the tackle's not that bad, is it? Alright, so apparently we're in the final round up here. But we're still getting just basic mouths. Okay. Porygon, you should really face the right way when you do that. <laughs> so that hard, that hardening is so OP. That hard, yeah, it is ridiculous. Who would have thought the Geodude would be the tank that took? Like, it's full health! Geodude is like full health. Look at all these buffs it's got on there. I don't even know what half of them do. It's giving them to everyone though, which is the which is the great thing. Alright. Oh, come on, finish this mouth. Geodude literally has full health. Is that a per that is the weirdest looking Persian I've ever seen. It almost looks like an absent. With, with its ears. That look like a horn thing. Anyway, this Persian's getting wrecked. Oh. Geodude finally had a bit of damage done to him. Alright. I feel like I should take this off order. There's really too much stuff happening. Okay, so we already have seven berries and one gen uh, module. Hopefully we'll get a few more from this Persian. Yeah, Porygon again. <sighs> right, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna take it. I'm taking over. Sidebeam for you. We'll go a hard one. Porygon needs to get a flamethrower. Look at him and then flamethrower. There we go. That's what we do. Um, we can go Sidebeam now. We'll go Tackle on Geodude. Yeah, so this is working. If there's one Pokemon in front of me, I can sort of deal with it. I did not click that. I don't know why you did that automatically. Um, let's go with actually. Oh no, Persian's dead. Right, I'll take this off auto. Right. I'll have to remember next expedition, otherwise, I'm gonna kick myself. Oh, so we did get two. Okay. Pink Christian Plane, what have we got? Any level ups? No. Alright, that's cool, that's cool. Which one of these did we get? That's a big one. Alright, we're gonna chuck those on straight away. Um. And we're also going to... Okay, so let's go... Okay, no, it is still cooking. Okay, so we've got a base camp. Oh, no, it doesn't. It's got an empty pot. All right. All right, so we want a Machamp. So we need three sweet and two mushroom. Sweet is a blackberry or honey. So that's a blackberry or... Where's the honey? Wait, what? Or oh, honey. I don't think I've got any honey, do I? Oh, there's honey. Um, so I think we might need to do this three one, to be honest. Uh, I don't think we have enough for ten. So we need three of these. I have to start using these. And two mushrooms. Oh, that's only one. I've only got one mushroom. Tiny mushroom. Oh, okay. So we've got the... Actually, no, I can use these. So it's frustrating. I think using this pot just means that um, the level of the Pokemon is lower. But that's okay for now. Um... Let's just start cooking, shall we? Um, yes, I do understand that. All right, so that's four, which means I, th I don't actually I don't really know what that means. I think it might be random each time. I'm not too sure. Um, just checking. There's no Pokemon around that I'm unaware of. No. Nah, okay. So four means we're going to get it by the end of this episode anyway. All right, let's jump in. Actually, no, let's not jump in. Let's go edit team. And let's go put some power stones on these. Poke E monsters. Alright. Porygon's um our lowest level now. Even though it's a bit of a tank. Um oh I've got another page. Uh, okay, so I don't have Pikachu, so that's the weight less stone. Um should, should, no, I'm not gonna I'm gonna put that on Abra. So, first of all, um what did I get? I got 218. So I might actually put that on Porygon, considering he's only got 173 and he's only got one heart. If we jump over to Porygon, we can put this Weightless Stone, because Pikachu had it. So Weightless Stone can go there. Um, and then, what else have we got? We've got a 173. I'd, I'd rather a 170 with Critical Hit, actually. 
uh, and a 162. So the only other Pokemon that could go on is Geodude, unless he has better. 173, um, easy, easy overtake there. 160, ooh, 133 with those, those perks are good. Oh, 122. Hmm, I just, um, nah, okay, that's it. Nah, that's the best we can do, I reckon. So that helped our team out a bit. What do we want now? 3664. I've seen some game players where they're up to like 20,000, and it is just ridiculous. All right. Let's do round two on this one. We nailed the first one, and I'm already remembering that I've got to take it off auto. So put it on auto, sorry. All right, so I'm trying to think of um, competitive play here now. Like, I'm trying to think of what the best setup is. Having a defensive tank is definitely a good idea. So the fact we've got Geodude, um, he's doing really well defensively. We've got, we've got Porygon here, he's a bit of a tank also, but he's a high hitter. Um, I think I think Abra here is a range, so he can shoot those he can shoot those side beam or whatever he's got, and it, and it sort of just fills up the whole screen, so it can go, go fairly far away like that, like it hit right down the bottom of the screen there if it needed to. So we've got three berries. Um, I really don't know what Pokemon we're going to have in the end with that incursion already. So maybe a Pidgeot could be a Pidgeot. Who knows? I might give. I want to teach some new moves though, because Porygon having a Thunderbolt it is a good move, I guess. But, definitely no stat. And Flamethrower, I mean, Flamethrower is, is a pretty high DPS move, um, if he hits. Abra definitely needs another attack. I, I, actually, I don't think he can, because Sabium has those three stone things. But Sabium's a good attack anyway. It's low, but it, it, it keeps using it, and it's a good range attack. Geodude can definitely do with another move. I think um, I read somewhere that Dig is a good move for Geodude. Uh, especially as well for Golem. We've got some Spearow and a Fearow for the first time, I think. I think that's our first Fearow. Oh, does this have a Pokedex? Oh, it does have a Pokedex, doesn't it? That's right. Um, we'll have to have a look at that. Because um, I remember the last time I looked at it, those the first couple of pages were just completely empty. And I felt like I just wasn't achieving enough as far as my Pokédex entries went. Alright, we're on the, uh... Oh, it is a Pidgeot. It is a Pidgeot. Alright. It looks it looks like the same sprite as the Pidgeotto, though. Just with a long hair on top. Porygon! You stupid little bird thing. Alright. Sidebeam. Let's go Flamethrower. And we're gonna go hard. Let's make sure we're nice and hard. Alright. Um, Porygon. Yep, I'll give you Flamethrower because it looks like you're facing the right way, finally. So, oh, Abra's up there. Abra, what am I doing? No one's attacking. I'm going to put it back on auto because so nothing was attacking even though I was clicking it. So Abra's dead. It was going one-on-one -on -one with this Pidgeot. Oh, Geodude is taking it. There we go. No. Okay, we just... Okay. Considering that there's only two Pokemon, I'm going to be... um. Get in there, get in there, get in there. Alright, harden up, harden up, harden up. Alright, Porygon, I'm going to tackle with you. Oh, Porygon nearly died straight away. Sit there and go Psybeam. Go on, get that, get it, get on. Yes! Actually, it's not even doing that much damage, to be honest. Alright, I think we've got this in the bag. Um, yep, that's definitely a ranged attack. Geodude's going to use Tackle. I should have used Harden, actually. Should have used Harden. Flamethrower. Okay, there we go. Bit of teamwork, guys. Killing it. Ooh, that looks like a good attack that we just got. Get some bulk experience. Ooh, Porygon nearly leveled up, but not quite. Ooh, 224. Nailing it. All right. So, we've done a quest. Maybe a Pokédex one, like the number of types of Pokémon. Uh, two long range and one close range Pokemon. Go on expeditions with two long range Pokemon and one. Okay. I thought we already did that, but, um. Whatever. 15 berries, I'll take it. I will take that. So, what I want to do is chuck that attack stone on. Because we're at 3600, which means we can just do this one. And we're working our way to 3900. Uh, so, let's go edit team. And I really want a new statue in my. In my um, oh! Fallout um, Bunker. Haven't played that. Looks good there. Um, just finished downloading. So, let's go to... I think Porygon needs some some attack. He's a, he's a high hitter. 
What's it? actually who's low? Ooh, Geodude. But Geodude is not really a high hitter. He's just a defense. He's a def he's a death knob. Uh, 224. Mmm, he's only. I think he he could really use with the attack. He could really use the attack. I mean, let's do that. Let's change that and let's give Abra that one with the perks. Uh, where are we? Here. Um, Abra, 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 Abra. Yep, this one here. That's what I'm replacing. Cool. Um, and we've got that one. 133. Yep, that makes sense. All right. So not huge changes in our overall. We're at 3750. Uh, so we should easily be able to take on this one and the next one. It should be 3600. Oh, 4500. All right. We'll see where we go after this one. We'll have a look at training. We might have to go back and do another. Might have to do this one again or something. Get some experience because um, which one was close? Porygon was close to leveling up, I think. All right. So far, we've found no Pokemon. Ooh, Magnemite. That's cool. What we actually might have to start doing after this is thinking seriously about Pokemon types, potentially. Actually, you know what? Surely not. I don't, surely that... Surely if you have a good team, you can you can bring it through every dungeon. You don't have to worry about Pokemon types being boosted. Oh, well, that was easy. You didn't have to go on an expedition to find them. Haha, <laughs> get it? Expedition? I'm hilarious. Oh, it's on auto again. You know, I sit here, I'm like, oh, this is really boring. They're not really doing many attacks. They're just going, blur, 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 blur. And then I realize, yeah, we have a Voltorb. Oh, that Voltorb just got consumed. I wonder what this is. Oh, that's his attack, isn't it? Ah, oh, so there's a bar around the Pokemon that counters his attack sort of um, count timer. Right, we've got a lot of Pokemon here. We've had Magnemite, Voltorb, Diglett, and now Graveler. And none of them are even related to each other. Oh, Graveler is paralyzed. Or something. Alright, we're just making a complete mess of this dungeon. They're killing it. Alright, what's next? Easy. Oh, oh, is that an Onyx? That's insane. I really want an Onyx. Actually, I want a shiny Pokemon. I think I think if I use my, those um, special ingredients, there's a chance I get shiny Pokemon, but I don't want to risk it yet. Because um, I don't know exactly what they're for. I haven't, to be honest, I haven't researched enough about recipes to know. I know the basic amount, and some of you guys are even telling me and trying to teach me stuff, and appreciate it, but I haven't looked into it that much, so I'd rather save it up. Is Onyx confused? How does that happen? It must be one of his moves that confuses himself, because... Unless Sardin can confuse a Pokemon. But I haven't had it happen yet. Either way, Onyx is just getting obliterated. It'd be good if you uh, came and joined the battle, Porygon. Oh, what was that? Is that a water-type move? You know what, I'm pretty confident... Oh, actually, no, this dungeon does j jump up a lot, doesn't it? It went from 3,300 to 4,500, so... I thought I was gonna say we could, we might be able to take it on because we did so well at this one, but I don't know about that. I just don't know. Okay, we have some new modules. Uh, how close is Porygon? Level up, level up. Oh, we got to level up from Porygon. Nothing else in the module department. 163. That's all right. Probably not. Um, probably no make or break. That's for sure. So actually, 3,900, we could be closer to that. What have we got? 42. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? Let's do it. We're only 145 off. I believe in us. And now we have the addition of Abra. Um, Mankey? Well, what was that? What was that? What was with all the, um... What's that? Have I... Maybe I haven't played this um, level... What is that? Why am I getting explanation marks? This is freaking me out, man. Porygon, you need to do the Thunderbolt. I'll do it for you. There we go. Alright, back onto auto. Alright, I'm glad I'm still full HP almost. That Harden is the best thing that's ever happened to my team. <laughs> Slash Geodude. Alright, use Harden again, use Harden again before we go there, before we get there. Oh, okay. That's nice. Back onto auto. Got some Growlers. Whoa. You absolutely nailed them. Okay. We got a Rapidash? No, it's a Ponyta. Is that a... I don't know. I think it's a Ponyta. 
it's hard to really tell with these uh, very pixelated graphics. Yeah, this is a strong team, man. Look at that. The opponents just stood no chance. We only have two berries there, which is kind of annoying. I need berries. I thought there were so many berries at the start of the game, but negative. Ooh, Arcanine. He'll be easy. Trust me. Right, let's go over here. Let's use Harden first up Geo. Let's go. Harden up. Let's go. Side in. Let's go Flamethrower. Probably could have used uh, Flamethrower. I mean, uh, I said Thunderbolt, but uh, I mean the other way around. I said Flamethrower, but... Okay, Thunderbolt. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Yes, okay. Abra uses that. Could probably go another Harden, for sure. Uh, let's kill this. Why is my Porygon just all by its own to over here? Why is it the only one that I'm looking at? <laughs> Alright. Let's go tackle here. Uh, we've got Abra. So we've got to just get Abra and Geodude. I'm going to spam this Psybeam. Uh, I'm going to spam this tackle. And then we're going to go hard enough after this. Come on, harden, 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 harden. Alright, we've got Harden and Psybeam. We could just tank the rest of this boss. Because remembering, this boss is actually higher than um, what we should be able to handle. Oh, there we go. Flame Soul for days. We'll go another hard and support and get to the effect as well. I don't know if that's supposed to be it or is that just a glitching out big time. Okay, go flamethrower. Go another tackle. Yeah, Arcanine. Well played, bruh. Just uh, not well enough. Ooh, 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 ooh. That looks like a good health um, health module. Uh, we've got Geodude upper level. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is it Graveler? So this is our first evolution. All right. Oh, it doesn't have the full dun 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 sort of music in the background, but that's cool. Graveler, congratulations, your dear dude evolved into Graveler. Awesome. Ooh, ooh, oh, did I just see that go up? I think that just went up. Look at his HP. That is insane. That just went up so much. Sturdy Stone, that's a good one. 179 with buffs. That might give us it. That's that's crazy. 4-2, yeah, we're way ahead. That gives us our first um, health over a thousand challenge, I think. No, evolution. PM tickets. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna buy some stuff too. Alright, so now that we're sitting at 42 flipping 100, we could go take on this. But before we do, remembering that we only have one more expedition before the cooking pot as well, I might chuck. Oh, it doesn't really matter which one I choose, I'll just go into it. Just check what our uh, stones we've got were. We've got a 162 health, so um, uh, let's chuck it on Geodude because he's got a, oh no, he's got a 133, but it's gold. Uh, 162, let's swap it out with this one for a start because it's got a buff. Uh, anyone over here? Porygon's got some low attacks. Hmm. Oh, we got that one. We'll chuck that on Porygon because, uh, like I said, Porygon has is um, lacking in the attack department big time. Let's give him this one. Hmm. Right, let's give him this one. Alright, so he's turned into a beast. An absolute flippin' beast. Um, Alright. I don't think I have any stones over here that I could use. Poliwag. Oh! Poliwag's got that. Um, I could chuck that on Flamethrower because we don't have Poliwag anymore. There we go. We definitely have all them though. Um, Porygon, you still got a 68. Is that actually good? Movement speed, HP upon recovery. Surely I have a better one than that. Um, not on that page. Time to, movement speed, time to recover. Let's just let's just go with that because... Alright, there we go. That should put us over the threshold for the next expedition. Um, which is 4200, we're at 4392. Absolutely killing it this episode. We've been doing well on these expeditions so far. All right, Gravel is a big guy. Look at him. Oh, we got some Cadabras. Apparently, a um, Alakazam is a really good Pokemon as well. So, can't wait for Abra to evolve and then evolve again. And I've read somewhere um, they've done some data mining on this game and. Uh, the rumors are that they will be introducing potentially all, all the generations of Pokemon into this game at some point, just like they're doing with Pokemon Go, how they've they started with the original and now they're slowly introducing their future generations. So we may even get Porygon 2, but I doubt that I'll still have Porygon on my team by then. Maybe, who knows? Porygon's a cool Pokemon. 
He um he gets a lot of slack. Oh, it's on auto. It's on auto. Oh, I feel sick. Sorry, guys. Sorry. All right, please use harden. Please use harden, or I'll just use it for you. All right. Actually, I'm getting better at doing this. I just got to get used to the hotkeys. Um, so we got to go there. Let's just use that. Side beam. Execute. Side beam. Let's go with a flamethrower. And we'll go with that. Yeah. Okay, now. So I don't need to keep pointing my arrow. I've got hotkeys on my um, controller. And there are more hotkeys. There's one that scatters everyone, but I forget which button that is. I should... Ooh. Mum and Dad here. Uh, what do we want? We want a Thunderbolt to get rid of them. Boom. Good job. We want another hard one. Right, we're doing well. I don't, there's so many arrows, I don't know which one's mine. Whoa, 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 what's happened here? He's been like locked out of attacks or something. Oh, so is Gravela. Okay, so Kedavra must have an attack. Um, what's that attack called? That stops you from using your like, cool move or something? I don't know. I don't know how it works in Pokemon Quest, but it must be similar. Right, there we go. Yes. Kedavra, you idiot. Alright, so let's keep doing this. There's a, there's a hot button for that, but I just don't know what it is. Um, um, I'll, I'll find it, I'll find it. Is it that? 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 Aha, uh -huh. okay, it's left trigger. It's left trigger. And I'm going to keep doing it so my Pokemon can heal up. It's a bit of a uh, coward thing to do. Oh, we got a Hypno. Right, I'll do it one more time, one more time, one more time. One more time. Oh, alright. And we're going to chuck a shot into auto for now. Actually, no, I'm going to use Harden straight up. Just to make sure we're in the zone. Um, Porygon, you're going to use uh, Thunderbolt, actually. Psybeam. Oh, okay, so my freaking Gravel is snoring away. I guess that's what you do. That's what happens when you verse a Pokemon called Hypno. Alright, so Porygon just smash that Drowsy down there. Um, Graveler, are you going to wake up anytime this century, buddy? Oh, okay. Coming to save the day. Graveler, we really need you to use Harden. Why is he still going? Okay, Harden, Harden, Harden. Whoa, he just put two Pokemon to sleep. Lucky Abra's still awake. Holy crap. Abra's nearly dead too. Abra's dead. So I literally... Ha oh, there we go. Harden. Let's go. Thunderbolt. Let's go. Go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. Oh. Stop putting my Pokemon to sleep. Alright, po Porygon, move up, move up. We need Flamethrower. We need Flamethrower. Big time, go on. Mm. I'm just going to need a Thunderbolt then. Are you even going to hit him? Hit him once. Our Abra needs to wake. I mean, not wake up, but... Uh, it still didn't work. There we go. Sit back there, Abra. I wonder if you can get him to sit back and not actually come up to the front like that. Okay, so my Geo... My Geo dude, my Gravel is still moving. Okay, hard and hard and hard and hard. This is actually a hard battle. Hypno's dead, though. That was actually the first time I actually think about what to do properly. It was good. I have to say, ooh, that is a good module. We have no level up. So, ooh, Porygon is close to level 20. I still don't know what these are. The lights there. That is big. All right, I'm putting those on. I don't think I've got any more expeditions left, though, do I? I'll have one after I finish doing my base camp stuff. First of all, let's have a look at this quest. Challenge. Psychic investigation, defeat 50 psychic. Alright. So, wonder what we've got. What were we hoping? We're hoping for a Machop. Then we have a Machoke and then a Machamp. Let's um let's have a look see. To be honest, are we happy with any fighting type Pokemon from Gen 1? Fighting type. Alright, ready? And we have a that looks like a Machop. I think we had ourselves a Machop. Yes, we do. But it's only level, it's level two. You have got to be kidding me. Um, right, what is this? Bulk up, the user tenses its muscles to bulk up its body, raising the damage it deals for a while. This also reduces the damage the user takes. Whew, that would be so good to have as a share. That, I think I think that's what the um, OP move is of this Pokemon and Rock Smash. The user unleashes its fury damaging enemies in a broad area nearby. And that's what, it, you know what? This Pokemon could actually be insane on my team. Um, maybe even instead of, um, let's see, maybe even instead of, um, um, Abra or Porygon. Mm, how am I going to level him up though? We have a quest. What's this? 
Uh, tumble kit. Oh, so cook a dish ten times. Cool. Recipe collector six. Cool. All right. What else I'm gonna do is actually before I do anything, I am. What ingredients do I have? All right, so what we're gonna go for is a Snorlax. Actually, I wouldn't mind a Snorlax or a Kangaskhan. Apparently Kangaskhan's a great Pokemon too. So to do that, we need, where's our mushrooms at? Um, Balm Mushroom, Balm Mushroom, Blockberry. Where's our Blockberry? 30, so we have three of them and where's our fossil? Okay, so we're gonna chuck it into our, um, what does it say? More kinds of quick and pots will be unlocked as the, okay. So let's um let's put this one in. We need three blockberries. So let's go boom, boom. Actually, we could do that. We'll do two fossils and one honey. Where's the honey there? Is that the honey? Honey. All right. So hopefully, I think this attracts normal type Pokemon. Uh, yes. So we're hoping for a Snorlax. What have we got? Four. All right. That could be that could be a good that could be a good Snorlax. Um. We'll do one more expedition, and then we'll go and see what we can buy. We're at 43.92. Ooh, where are we gonna go? Where are we? Ah. Ooh, we're at the boss here already. Okay, I think we're gonna jump into this one. We're, not, we're almost there, but um, I think we can do it. We did the other, we did the last one, 150 lower, and this is only 100 or something, so. I've, it's not on auto, and I'm going to try and attack using these hotkeys. All right. So first of all, we're going to harden. This should be able to do first up. Oh, they've all got harden as well. Um, let's go with thunderbolt. Let's go with a nice tackle and a side beam. Oh, I'm not using the hotkeys. All right. Let's use the hotkeys. Getting used to this. Getting used to this. Porygon, you can use where you, you can use that, even though that yes, you can reach him. Abra, you can use your attack, and you can use harden again because. It's run out. Uh, ooh. Um, I guess you could use Harden again. I mean, it maybe makes sense to do it as much as possible when there's no Pokemon. Um, and we'll do... Oh, I don't even know how to get him to run away now. I keep forgetting. Um, it's not... The same button I'm pressing doesn't work. We're surrounded. Hmm? Well, let's do a Thunderbolt. Let's do a bit of a tackle. Ooh. Was that us that was confused? Well, then. A uh, beam either way. Psy beam and a Thunderbolt to get... Oh, that's, that's going to be... Yeah, that is a good spot for a Thunderbolt. All right, and we need another Harden. Um, Abra can do his Psy beam, which is actually not a bad attack. If you're facing... Probably on face, and then I'll get... There, there you go. Oh, no, don't even worry. Um, that was easy. Let's go Harden. All right, we're already up to the third and final wave. Remembering also that the boss is directly after this wave. Um, when I see the Pokemon, I'm going to harden. Just to give us the full buff, right? We've got some Cubones, maybe a Marowak in there as well? No, just Cubones now. Okay, that's all right. Let's go with that, there we go. Hitting some Cubones. Graveler, ooh, no, we'll go to Tackle. Big attack. Gravel up, let's go another, ooh, Porygon and Gravel up another hard one. All right, so more Pokemon, still no end of dungeon sort of Pokemon. I wonder if that attack from Abra, if, if it goes through them, it keeps attacking Pokemon behind it. Oh, Abra, you're surrounded, man. Tackle, there we go. Graveler is a big guy. Um, oh, 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 there we go, Flamethrower, perfect time. Yes, there we go, bit of Harden, Psybeam. We should be all prepared for the final Pokemon, which is a Marowak. All right, straight into it. No messing around here. Tackle, Siving, and make sure... Oh, get into it! Get into it, Marowak! Move into it! Dang, damn it! Let's go another hard one. Definitely a Siving. Ooh, he's got, like, boomerangs. That's cool. No, don't use that. Oh, well. You're too far away to do anything from there. Porygon. All right, this Marowak's going down pretty easily. I feel like once you get a bit of a team with when you know what's going on, it, it, it's, it's pretty easy actually. Like now that we're, we've got this hardened down pat, we've got these ranged attacks down pat from Abra. It's just it's just making sure you do it in the right. Oh, Abra's nearly dead. And if I can help it, let's go harden. 
Oh, no, Abra's dead, definitely. Um, but Marowak is almost nearly dead, so there's probably no point in me doing anything else. Maybe one more tackle and just, there we go. So hopefully we get some experience from this. We might have to go and level up. Uh, oh, what was that behind that? Was that a big mushroom or something? We might have to go level up um, Machop, because he can be a real addition to this. 221, okay, we've got some, we got some more uh, stones there. Which look like that can be pretty helpful. Oh, 50, 5,100, 54, 48. We could do that one next if we just edit our team a little more. Right, let's do this quickly now. Um, let's just jump into one of these. Power, let's go to this one. Put those rattles so we can level up too. Or use for training even. Okay, so we have a, we have a big health. I might give that to... Oh, Geodude's, uh, well, it's, it looks like it still has the same picture, but it's Graveler. Probably the same picture for all of them, to be honest, because um, they all look have the same face. We might give this one to Graveler, because he is a huge tank, and I never want him to die. So I'm going to put that there. Um, oh, that's a new one too, with buffs. I'm going to put that there. Okay, so now that he's buffed beyond Oblivion, let's go to Abra. Because Abra died that last one, so I really need you to have some more HP. Um, what has got? 170, 171. Um, how about 179? You'll take it. And 173. Actually, I'd rather give him buffs, critical hit damage. Hmm. Oh, 171. One, wait, 7.8. Yeah, that's better. Okay. I don't, that's really not going to help much, <laughs> but I'll do it anyway. Um, and attack 197. Yeah, I'll give it to you. You probably really need it. And we'll do Porygon and give it the best of what we've got left. Because he's already got high stats in general. We'll give him that one instead of... I think it's time to get rid of that for sure. Um, 173. Um, that's, probably, that's probably it. We've. That's it. Alright, so just make sure they're all Poliwag. Pikachu. Porygon has a 135. We have a 138. There we go. We'll give him that one. I don't think we've got any other better attack. Oh, no! That button is so annoying. Why is it even there for? It shouldn't be that hard, though. I'll just give him all the ones that aren't used. Um, that one. And that one. So, should this 173 be going to anyone? Maybe Geodude? Time to recover? Uh, 10 not that big of a difference. I'd rather give him time to recover. Okay. So. Now what are we sitting at? 4,700. Boom. Easy. There's a Machoke. That is a good looking Machoke. Um, Alright, let's have a look at training. Just before we do end the episode, what we want is Abra has an alright move. Porygon could do with another move. Actually, let's have a look at leveling up. If we wanted to level up Abra, for example, we chucked a little Machoke in there. It would not do much at all, but if we level this 22... Mm, see, it wouldn't do much at all either. Hmm. But if I had this guy in there and... Oh, I don't even have that Rattata anymore. Whoopsie. Alright, let's have a look at move learning then. So we've got... So that's the only one... Okay, I see, I see, I see. I'd rather get... I want to get rid of... I definitely want to get rid of that. So if we put Jazzy in there, it's 12%. If I put a Rattata in there, it's 12%. So what are we looking at? Graveler is rock ground, I think. Um, so I don't, I don't have any other rock grounds. 11%. That's painful. What if we put Poliwag in? Hmm. I don't really want to... What else do we have? We have... Is that a normal? So if I pack Porygon in there, and I have another normal Pokemon, say, Pidgey. Yeah, okay, so it does work like that. And then... Hmm. Who else is normal here? Pikachu, nobody's normal. Rattata, Rattata is normal. That's going to be 100% straight off the bat, isn't it? Alright, oh, 60%. Alright, you know what I might... Oh. I think I might get rid of this Pidgey and just hope for the best. Um, actually, you know what? They're not the worst moves. They're not the worst moves. I'm doing alright. So let's have a look what we can buy with these PM tokens. Or PM tickets, sorry. Uh, 225 was that okay so let's go decorations for now because i think we don't really need box expansions a charizard torch in size of red ingredient okay so we definitely need some of these um drop things 
uh, ingredient drop, blue ingredient drops. Um, Venusaur is yellow ingredient drops. Ditto Balloon. Success of, uh, okay, so this could be really helpful. Success of Moon Move Learning Training 1.5. We can buy that. Level up. Oh, okay. What's this one do then? A number of ingredients received from Recycle 1.5. Meowth Balloon, number of ingredients for Recycling Tumps 2. I'm guessing you can have both of them and it does like a maybe a 2.5. Um, with a chance of Pokemon with a, with a multi socket. What is that? Um, Mewtwo Arch, battery, maximum battery charges plus one. Hmm, that's pretty cool too. Uh, collecting po a chance of attracting multiple Pokemon with your cooking, 1.5. Okay, that's pretty cool actually. Multiple Pokemon with my cooking. I didn't realize that was an actual thing. Um, I think what we need to save up for, to be honest guys, is... Um, actually, you know what? Yeah, is it, I think it's the drop one. Because we don't do much leveling up yet. So, I, ooh, what does this one do? Chance for a Pokemon with a multi-socket. Uh, do you guys want to let me know what a multi-socket is? Because I might just... I don't know whether it's worth buying that. What I think I'm, we, we need to save up for is either a Charizard, Blastoise, Taurus, Venusaur... Um, yeah, one of those four. Um, so I'll be able to probably get that in the next episode, I'm guessing. And Box and Stone Box expansion, which I don't think I need just yet. Actually, 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 actually... Wouldn't be too far off needing that, would I? If I go into Power Charms here... Jump on down into the next page... Mm, we're actually maxed out. Ooh, let's recycle this. Let's recycle this bad boy. Let's go that one. Oh, it's because it's a Pokemon on it. Dang it! Let's... How do we get out of here? Where do we... Oh. Where are we, Poliwag? Let's take all your power charms off of you. There's got to be a better way to do this than this. Boom. All right, what else do we have? We have Pikachu with one as well. So let's go into Pika, Pika, Pikachu. Oh, I saw the gameplay of Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go Eevee today. Insane. I'm so pumped for that game. It's ridiculous. All right, let's go recycling. Let's get rid of that, that, that. I'm going to say that, 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 that. I don't even know if this is a good or a bad idea. That. I'm not. I'm going to keep that platinum looking one and the gold one. Yeah, let's get rid of those. Uh, what do we get? Would you... Uh, which, yes. Ooh, actually some decent uh, ingredients from that. Cool, that gives us some more space. But I think we might actually need a new box sooner rather than later. Um, but we can do that after we buy the next thing anyway. So... That about does it for that episode. I think there was one more thing I was going to do. Hmm. I can't think of it now, though. Oh, the cooking pot. That's right. How could I forget the most important thing? Oh, no, it's not done yet. I thought it was done. That's right. No, I just do did it. Okay. No. So next episode, we'll definitely get that repop. Um, hopefully, a Snorlax will come through. Um, we'll take on those worlds. I'll probably be able to finish, I reckon at least two of those three bosses so we get a couple more statues and we'll buy one of those um decorations for our thing anyway guys thanks for watching if you enjoyed the video leave a like it helps support me and the channel uh, subscribe if you enjoyed and until next time guys see ya